Good morning. Good afternoon. And good evening. As you can I'm see, Brian. Brian courtesy, courtesy, uh, was nice enough to make me flight. Made us an endergenic generator, um, some dialing devices. Um, once we actually get a base base, I'll show off all his work because he's done a lot. Yeah, like I said, we need some. We could use some conduit speed upgrades for this. But today we're gonna work towards getting a spawner changer. That we need empowered diamantine. Um, we're gonna need diamantine. So I'm just gonna get the diamantine ready. Um, I already have stuff to make a spawner with. Cause I got a soul binder made. No, 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 no. So cause I, cause I want to make a villager spawner, and you can't do that with Ender IO. So we gotta use oh, the right. spawner changer from Actually Editions. Now we're gonna need to empower this. So we're gonna need an empowerer, which requires a display stand. So we need, uh, we're gonna need five of these total. So that's fifteen aesthetic quartz and fifteen aesthetic green blocks. So let's grab our quartz. And don't forget to mention, we can fly now. What? We have angel rings. We can fly. Yes, but we don't I have... I like lost boy. <laughs> but we don't have unlimited emeralds, which I'm going to change. Um, tell you what. Can you, uh, Brian, can you make us yeah. a nice big smeltery? One that can hold a, a whole spawner? Mm, yeah, I should be able to. Alright, so we're going to need a total of 30 blocks of quartz. We're going to need 10 more, which is... So we need 39. Okay. But in the meantime... Make you... Make you... Alright. We're going to need a decent amount of anori. Uh, we, we do not have automated ore processing. We do not. No. <laughs> Alright. Uh, tell you what. You guys don't need to see a bunch of crafting, so I will just be back once I'm done with all the crafting needed. And we're back. Um, so I was just in another getting a drop of evil, because I need that to make a restore mob spawner. As you can see, I've got the display stand and power in my inventory. Uh, Brian, while you're at home, can you go ahead and whip together some energy conduits? Sure can. Thank you. Alright. So the one thing we're going to need is we're going to... Oh, I also upgraded my sword blade to manual in with quartz. Um, we're going to need to find an existing mob spawner. Not a broken one, one that's fully intact. We've got an abandoned mine shaft not too far from us, right? Yeah, there's one below us in the main world and one in the dark world. Alright, so we got options for, uh, for finding mob spawners. Alright. Where do you want the empower set up? Well, we're going to need it next to the power station to start with. So, next to the church. Alright. Let's see, so... Display stand, one, two, three. Power. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. three. Alright. So now we just need to give this thing power. Alright, so we need clay, 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 and light blue dye. That's easy. We got bones for days. Like, I could sag mill these bones over here, but I'm not going to bother because we have so much. Yeah, we do. Like, we have 32 stacks, and soon we'll get more. We also have two stacks of iron from the mob spawner, just letting you know. Oh, nice. Yeah. Because zombies occasionally drop iron. All right. Once we hook this thing up to power, we will have um, empowered diamantine. And then we're gonna want the changer of ways, which oh, we need magma cream. 
Gosh diddly darn. Do we we have slime balls, right? Somewhere? Oh we, we have three magma cream already. Don't need you, okay? They got jumped by a bunch of slimes when we're in there looking for the skeletons. Guys, don't eat it, okay, Daddy? Okay, Daddy, you have your own cake. Alright, so I just need one more slime ball. There you go. You got power? Oh. No, I had to help a kid real quick. Oh, okay. I'm cooking up. What on earth happened to the spawner shards? Because those are kind of highly important. They should be in the chester. I, I got found one. them. You found them? Yeah, in the chest. I must be blind. There they are. Okay. How you doing, farmer? You got plenty of rice for me? Yeah, you do. If you need to kill a farmer, you can kill this potion guy. Um, or the shadow guy. Yeah, I, the I do heart. need to consume a villager's soul. Yeah. Don't take my librarian. I kill you. <laughs> what are we gonna need him for? He's got soul binds. Yeah, but we we can make an enchanter. But mommy kill the potion guy. But emeralds are cheaper. Pretty soon they will be a lot cheaper. All right, I'm just gonna temporarily steal the power cell to give these things power. Ooh, we got eight more draconium dust. Nice. I'm gonna need a chest for that. I was waiting up for the iron to cook up, so I can make the conduits. Don't let mommy go though. Hope you guys all play good. Okay, daddy. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> Hello, Brian's kid. Guys are really good. What's up? Potion guy, what if you die and you need a potion, a healing potion? We don't need that potion guy. She objects to everything I do in Minecraft. Especially if it involves hurting villagers or animals. <laughs> All right. Uh, need me to go sleep? Nah, I ain't going Let's see if that toy is running. What toy? So someone out there. Who thinks way too highly of himself? Yep, there goes. Watch this guy. Oh, the uh, celestial orrery. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, what villager can I murder? Uh, there's this potion guy right here. The one who just went through the door. And there's a shadow villager, full of shadow trader guys. Yeah, I don't need you. Boop. All right. Where is the man in mine shaft? I got an entrance port over here. Behind the redstone enabled, uh. Yep, what, right call it, The mob tomorrow. Alright, into the depths I go. Alright. Come on, spiders, where are ya? Nope, wrong way. I think I see a spawner. Nice, that was quick. Uh, I lied. I don't see a spawner. You might have already gotten it. I know I removed one from in here. Yeah. There's usually like three or four of them. Oh, hi, skeleton. Die, skeleton. I should I should have cleaned up my inventory before coming down here. That's why I made you a bag. <laughs> I don't have it on me. Uh, do we have an ender bag to feed into our drawer system? No, not yet. Alright. I and mean, we have the resources to make that, don't we? 
We should. Ah, two creepers. All right, uh, I'm dropping the gunpowder because we have unlimited amounts, and the string, and the bone, and the arrows. Because I bought, got us a resonating crystal. We got a lot of those. Yep. Hi, Skeleton. You know what? Whatever. You can live. I don't care enough to kill you. I don't even care enough to kill you, Enderman. I see you. <laughs> That's Delta, Delta Mania. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Oh gosh, I'm lagging. I was lagging for a moment there. Yes! Spawner! You, cave spider, die. All right, we got a disturbed mob spawner of villager. Sweet. Oh, no, there is one question. How do you get out of this place? Ha, uh, I'm digging straight up. Uh, I was doing some more lighting because it's so dark down here. Yeah, I ran out of torches. We got a whole lot of red dots around us. Oh. Alright, we'll be back once uh once I make it to the surface. Just took a few minutes to get out. Hey, we got cows. Good job. Yep. Didn't notice, did, not, did, did not notice we had cows. Hey, got the mother. Alright, uh, where's our coal? Because I want to make some more torches. Just so I have some on me. Whoops, did not mean to make that much tiny coal. Oh, found all the mobs. All right. So the restored mob spawner is pretty simple. It spawns villagers. Yeah. Uh, how much grid power do you have? Um, 449? Yeah, we couldn't quite get rid of that. Okay, in which case, um, I'm going to want you to put speed upgrades in the restored mob spawner, because I only have 48 grid power. Okay, let me... Why is this iron golem attacking me? Screw you, iron golem. I'm Did you attack the villager? <laughs> it, was a, it was an evil villager. He was black. That... That came out wrong. <laughs> yeah, it did. <laughs> oh, I think this is my way up. There we go. All right. So we're going to want to make some speed upgrades. 20 of them. Let's see, red coal. I don't know, I'm not much of an efficiency boost for the red coal. Uh, what's with this guy? Looks like I'm an evil villager hiding out in the sugar cane. Told you! Um, <laughs> that's from the spawner. I didn't think those guys spawned villagers. Um, Reister mob spawners do when you hit them with a villager changer, spawner changer. Uh -huh. Alright. 
So what we need to do right now is we need to get ourselves a larger, um, a much larger smeltery. So you can actually make um, seared brick by putting stone in the smeltery. So that's what I think I'm going to do. You just cook stone? stone? <laughs> yeah, just smelt stone and you get it. Alright, so we'll be back when we have a significantly larger smeltery. Alright, we're back. Um, so, Hello again. Yeah, so I actually put blood in there. I need to figure out a way to get that out. Or maybe I we can get blood. Yeah. I just need a drain. Uh, there's a... Here's a faucet right here. Alright. Alright. So, what we're going to want is we're going to want X-Net. Right. Let's get started with X-Net. Because that should enable us... Ooh, you had a wrench. Thank you. Yeah. I listen sometimes. Now you're very handy to have around. I will definitely say that. You're uh, welcome. So we're gonna need some iron, some gold, some quartz, some redstone. Yeah, quartz is an issue. Redstone's not. <laughs> Where can I gold? And we got a decent chunk of quartz, enough to get started. I think we're out of power again. Uh, toss some ender pearls in there. We got it. Chicken mods? What chicken mods? Oh, no, bullcrap. The chickens act like the bees used to. Oh. You can have chickens laying like obsidian eggs, draconic dust eggs. How did blood get in there again? I did not touch it. Are these guys dropping blood? No, they shouldn't. Weird. I probably want a half slab on top of the spawner. Yeah, I tried putting a vector plate up there, but it didn't work. I got some right here somewhere. Okay. Alright, I'm just doing that. That'll stop them from spawning on there. I don't right. Thanks. So, back to making uh, what I was doing, which is making an XNet controller. If I can find where I left my machine frames. I made four. There they are. So, I'm going to need redstone comparator. I'm going to need some smooth stone. Luckily, we've got plenty of granite and andesite and all that, and diorite. We should have plenty of smeared, smeared stone, right? No, no, I needed smooth stone. Well, yeah, but we can stop the foundry so I can steal the lava. Oh, yeah, go ahead. We're going to run out at the villagers real quick. Oh, it doesn't take lava. No. No, it, it, I just need a lob in there to melt it the first time. Huh. Okay. Yeah. Also, we have our first block of emerald from this. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Um, gonna need a power cell. Alright, definitely next episode is when we're going to want to get um, 
refined storage or something. Yeah, we need to figure something out. I'll go fly around and find us some asteroids. Alright, uh, I'm getting the call, so I'll be back in a moment. Alright, we're back. Uh, we were running low on power, so I just tossed some ender pearls into the pearl injector. And now we're going to need um, network cable, which is pretty easy to get, and a connector. Mm, how much lapis do we have? Well, we got a over stack. We're good. All right. So needing you. Uh, string. Where's our string? It's up by the mob spawner. Yep. Yay, having resources. Yeah, our quarry's humming along nicely. Yeah, we're doing pretty good for ourselves. We're getting the dimensional shards in. Should be able to start infusing stuff. Need a little bit of wood. Mahogany. Yeah. But I'm using oak. Mmm. It's getting a touch laggy. Mm. I'm hoping you guys can still figure out what's going on here. Oh, dang it, I need another connector. Um, yeah, too many people are watching us. Let's take a vote. Would you rather see us living in a huge ship, like a destroyer or the Enterprise, <laughs> or something more futuristic like a spaceship? Yeah, well, I'll let you know what the comments are like. Yeah, whatever. I'll, I'll sleep later. Um, gosh darn it, I hate hitting the signs by accident. So, I'm not going to need much, but I will need a Stone drum. That's just cobblestone. Oh no, it's also smooth stone. Alright. No. Yep to do, sleeping deep. Inventory, be less full. Gosh darn it, the ball's going to the crate. Alright. Should have everything I need to automate emeralds going out. Sweet. I may have lied. <laughs> no, no, I think I got it. Um, give me a hopper and a, uh, and a drawer and just hook it up to the bottom of this. Okay. Just so we can automatically get the emerald out. Okay. So, you will insert priority rate at a thousand filter okay I'm gonna need a bucket of emerald good job No show enough dirt to finish filling in that pond. A 
I'll make a nice crafting house, I guess. Alright, I should be able to do this all with just a molten emerald bucket. Automatically output with the let's just automatically output with the ender fluid conduit. All right, so that automatically outputs into here. So I don't need this anymore. So you will extract rate of a thousand filter no because that's a white list hmm oh I forgot those things My inventory is way too full. <laughs> you should fix that. I know, I know. Alright. Um... You keep pouring. Uh, gonna need some more tin. Ten, ten, ten. Five pieces of tin might not be enough. Luckily, we got ten ore. Temporarily get rid of you, put the tin on the bottom, put the bucket here, fill the bucket. Bucket of tin, and go back to Seer Stone. You know, I might not have to do any accident automation. It might just work on its own. Eh, I'm going to want to do accident automation. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what that thing is doing. Alright, so extract molten tin for 20 when white is active. You will be insert rate of 1000 molten tin. I don't care about max. You are just... Always active. Um... Hmm. Alright, so it looks like what I'm gonna need is I'm gonna need more basins. What do those do for you? Those are the things that make the blocks. Ah. Alright. We're probably going to want to do this with item conduits rather than hoppers, but that won't be hard to set up. I made all the resources to make the advanced energy conduits if you need power there. I just haven't put them together yet. Um, I already put a power cell over here. Yes, okay. So... 
create an XNet logic. Create. No. So you, I will create sensor output. So sensor. When receiving redstone of not equal to zero, output white. Be filling up. You're trying to fill it. I'm trying to fill the drum with tin because we need to cycle the tin out of the bottom and back into the top. Okay. Oh so yeah. Let's not do this with XNet. Let's see if we can't figure out a way to do this with uh, who's a call it? With uh, not that. I think I'm gonna need another drain. You, 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 you. Alright. I'm going to need. Uh. Let's see. Um, there's some fused quartz in the alloy smeltery. Go ahead and make me some more fluid conduits. Okie dokie. Uh, the under fluid conduits, of course. In the meantime, I will set that up. Gosh, diddly darn. Yeah, I'm not feeling the fused quartz. In the alloy smelter? Yeah, it's it's in the alloy smelter. You you know where our alloy smelter is, right? We have so many. <laughs> we have one. Like the Ender IO uh, alloy <laughs> smeltery. Oh, we have that. We have the redstone furnace that does the same thing. Then we have the big furnaces. But only one's called the alloy smeltery. I was I was hoping there'd be more. Alright. So if I am right, 
This should north whitelist. And then you north will be insert only list will be extract. Alright, so this should permanently keep the tin on the top. Yes. Alright, I've got it working. I've got it fully working. Sweet. So we will now have Emerald's Faux Days. Alright. So, what do you want to do with all these emeralds? Oh, I'm going to use a bunch of them to make upgrades for the storage drawers. And what else can we do with them? Um... We can make fortune enchantments for our tools that we have, uh, that we don't use because we use Tinker's tools. Yeah. We can make better armor. Because we have plus four armor for that. Plus, yeah, we can go ahead and make, uh, better armor. Yeah, better armor's good. Alright, well I think that's where I'm going to call the episode, so we'll be back next time, and we should finally get ourselves a refined storage system, because gosh darn, I, I do not like manual item stuff. <laughs> Later, guys. Laters.